Hey guys, so I just wanted to do a quick video from uh, uh, my haul of stuff that I bought from the 99 cents only store. I was on my way to Dollar Tree, uh, a different Dollar Tree than I normally go to, and right next to that was a 99 cents only store. So I went in there, uh, I picked up quite a few things. I think I kind of hit the jackpot on um, three major things that I wanted to get or have been wanting to get. So let me go ahead and start off with some of the more boring stuff of the uh, Easter stuff. Well, this is just a two pack of folders. This one's blue and they have the prongs and this one's black. So that's going to be for work, for stuff I need for work. I did go ahead and pick up this four pack of bubblegum eggs. But I believe they're separate individuals so I'm going to be making four Easter little gift boxes for some uh, kids that um, kids for my for, of my co-workers so for that I also bought a six pack of these animal cookies um, I don't know they're individually packaged so I just thought that was pretty cool so I'll have two left for me <sighs> I also finally um, bought these fortune cookies. I see them and I love fortune cookies. I can eat the whole box. But I finally bought them and I'm going to be using those for the probably the kids um, little bo gift boxes for Easter. And then the rest I will eat. So we'll see how that goes. Also picked up this pack of glow pops. These are the blue raspberry ones. And whatever I don't need for the boxes, I will eat. I also picked up two of these. These are Lunchables. It's dirt cake. These were four for 99 cents. And they're just like individually packaged. Of course, they're Valentine's because it says to and from. And it says be mine. But... I just thought that would be cool for the little um, uh, Easter gift box. And the other one that I bought, or other style or flavor, whatever, is the s'mores dippers. So, and these expire April 20th, 2015, so those will be well and done and gone. And lastly, of the Easter stuff, I picked up three of these it's a three pack of treat boxes for Easter so this is one style and then here's another and I guess there's one in the middle that's a different style but um so yeah so I picked up three packs of these so I have nine boxes and the next things that I picked up were these glasses. I picked up 11 of them. Four or five. No, I picked up... I hope I picked up 12. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. I think I just picked up 11. No. I don't know. Whatever. I just need those for um, Mother's Day gifts. That I'm going to be doing this year and I saw them they're pretty substantial thick glass pieces and these could be either the wine glasses but I'm going to be doing a DIY with these and hopefully I will stick to that because I normally will say oh I'm not gonna spend this much on this holiday for gifts for people but then I change my mind and end up you know, spending like five or six dollars on each person, which can add up since there's five co workers that I usually get stuff for, and then for Mother's Day, I'm gonna do um, the four doctors, so that's already nine people that times five, so that's already 40 bucks. So, so we'll see how this goes. Hopefully, I stick to my plan of doing a very inexpensive, maybe like two dollars a piece. So this buying this thing is already a dollar 
and then everything else I will buy will be something either well I use and the gift will already be something that I can that I already own or something that I will have to buy but will be enough to um, for 11 people so as I keep on uh, saying um, once Mother's Day comes or we get a little closer I'll go ahead and show you my DIY idea gift for that and next I did finally find these they were I think they were in Dollar Tree if I'm not mistaken but I never got them there but I finally found these little ring holders the little high heels with the bow so I got five different styles for the girls at work for their Easter gift so I did try to not spend a whole bunch I think it's like three dollars a piece for their gift maybe 325 a piece for their gift or something but um, that's part of it this one is I don't know just a different style I was gonna say paisley but it's not paisley so I just thought these were cute and I did try to pick the best ones with the as minimal nixing and stuff on them but so I just thought those were cute I have been looking for them for quite a while not for me because I don't really wear jewelry but for them I know they're really girly girls and love to shop and stuff like that so I just thought that was a perfect gift for them and my besides these two items my third awesome find was a, a ginormous stash of these color tattoos now I did not get that lucky to find them for a dollar as if I would have gone to Dollar Tree and found them but in none of my Dollar Trees have I found any color tattoos so I just went ahead and picked them up when I saw them and they're a dollar ninety nine each so first off I'll show you the different colors that I got this one is like a red or maroon it's not a pink it's a maroon what's this color? pomegranate punk the next one is a gold and this one is gold rush I think this one is one of the normal colors so I got two gold rush I also picked up this slate gray color smoky called audacious asphalt here is a second of that pomegranate punk. And this one is a lovely blue color, electric blue. Just a navy blue. And this one is the last. This was I only got one of these. I didn't want this color, but I needed five different colors for the girls at work. This is fierce and tangy. This is like in orange like a, a creamsicle orange it's not real bright it's pretty um toned down so it's not neon or anything a second of that asphalt one and a second of that electric blue so in total I got nine of those one two three four five six seven Nine. Four of them are mine. And the other five are going to be for the girls at work as part of their uh, Easter gift. So $3 and some change. So $1.99 plus the little shoe and whatever else of goodies I throw in their basket. And it keeps on going out of focus. Alright, you guys. Thanks for watching. And I will go ahead and post another video of how I end up doing these baskets.
So look out for that one.